Hey guys, welcome back to The Casual Puzzler. My name is Emily. This is a video that's not really puzzle related, but is going to be a part of a series. So if you missed one of my videos, I did mention that I want to make a puzzle studio. And so I'm in this room currently, which is going to be renovated to be my puzzle studio. And I want to give you a before. So this is going to be just me showing you around my rough idea of what I want to do. And then in future videos, you'll see me tackling some projects to renovate this into my puzzle studio. Now a little backstory about this particular room. When we moved into our house, we didn't really do anything to it. It's pretty much in the exact same state since day one. We did put in a desk for Dave so he could work from home during COVID. But other than that, it has the same wall color, same holes in the wall, same everything. And I'm excited to actually make it have a purpose. Right now we call it the office slash cat room. We do have a desk in here. The cat stuff is in here, but other than that, it, we don't use it. We really don't like it. So I'm gonna make it my room and I'm so excited. Let me just show you our before. And again, I'll just show you my thoughts. So let's just get started. When you enter the room and behind the door, this kind of just gives you an idea of just how much we just don't care about this room. We've had this picture behind the wall. I think it's from Ikea and it's just been hanging out here because we really don't have a spot for it and it's out of the way and so that's where it went and it does not fit there. But I do have an idea of like making this like a very simple backdrop. So if I want to do like a sit down video and just talk through it, I can just put like something cute on the wall and make it somewhat more homey so I can use it for, again, a backdrop for videos. But I don't know if I'm even gonna keep that picture, but just kind of gives you an idea just like how much we haven't done anything to this room. I don't know, I don't know if you can see the exact color currently just cause the lighting in here is kind of awful, but I put a picture on the screen. It used to be a baby boy's nursery with the previous owners. And so it's a very pale pastel baby blue green. And so I'm thinking, most of the walls will be like a taupey gray and then this wall is going to be like an accent wall with a navy blue so those are the colors i'm thinking of the floor is going to stay the same we will add a rug but it's just the same flooring throughout the rest of our house it's just wood um and so i'm going to do like a black and white patterny type of rug i'm guessing i'm thinking this wall will be taupey gray we do have this mirrored sorry for the glare um closet so we really don't have too much in the closet, I just have filming equipment. So I think I'll continue with the filming equipment in there, but I'm really not focused on that right now. Over here, we do have the desk that we put in. And as you can tell with the colors, this is kind of this color scheme. So I'm gonna continue on with like this black accent and this dark wood. So this desk we got at Birch Lane or online at Birch Lane. The chair is Amazon. And again, we put these in when COVID happened and Dave had to work from home. This is going to stay here, maybe decorated a little bit differently. So I need to set up my workspace for my real job. So I'm going to have like two monitors and a whole setup for my actual job. And then I will decorate above it. We have nothing there. Um, yes, I could have put the picture in an actual place, but we've never put anything up here. We'll do something, um, and then if you want to just be nosy, here's some things currently on the desk. We have some film. All those little coins are from ships Dave has worked on because he works on Navy ships. Um, we have a picture for when we were younger, and just some more pictures. Moving on, we have the cat corner. So we have the litter box, which will be moved to the guest room, and we'll just move it out when guests are actually here. So it'll just stay in there, out of the way, and then we will keep this here just because the cats love it and I don't plan on filming in that corner. So moving on to this wall here, this bookcase, which is just books, um, will go in a closet because we really don't need them out. But I do wanna have some type of like backdrop here, so I'll figure something out, nothing crazy, maybe just like a large plant or like a stand-up light. We will figure that out. Um, really, I'm not really focused on the decor right now, I kinda of just wanna like paint it and get it at least filmable. Um, and then we'll continue to spruce it up over time. See these IKEA desks? This used to be my desk that I will use for school, but I realize I don't use it. I don't like doing the schoolwork in here. I just never stay focused. So I'm just gonna sell that whole setup because IKEA stuff sells really well here. So I'm just gonna put it on Facebook Marketplace. And again, this whole 
wall will be like a taupey gray, but I think I'm gonna do some type of like secondary backdrop. And then the biggest project is going to be this wall here. Again, this wall is going to be like a navy blue. And then I will put in the inspiration that I found on Pinterest. Also, my work has the same exact thing, but it's this industrial looking farmhouse style shelving unit, which goes on the wall. And it's like these black metal pipes with dark wood. And me and Dave are not handy people. So I think I will film a video of us trying to make this happen, or it might be so stressful that it doesn't happen at all. But I really have high hopes we can figure it out. My boss said it was really easy to put in before, so I'm gonna try to do that project here. Um, I already priced it out and I feel like it will be really cool. And then I can decorate it and put puzzles there and make it really cute. Um, these things will be going, the printer doesn't even work anymore. That basket we've had for ages, but I could really see that put going in our living room. And then this old, um, and then this is the second of our end tables and two just don't fit in our living room. So I will keep the end table, just don't think it'll go in here. Although it does kind of work with the vibe because it has that dark wood with the black accent, so it probably will stay in here. Maybe I'll put it over here with some type of setup. Um, but yeah, that is my idea. And I'm so excited about it because right now this room just doesn't have a purpose other than the place where the cats go to the bathroom. Um, but I'm excited. So that is it for this video. I know it's not really puzzle related, but again, this is going to be part of a series of me redoing this whole space and making it a puzzle studio. I am so excited. I'm happy that my husband is on board with it. He is going to attempt to help me. Um, but step one in the next video is going to be just starting to get this room ready and probably painting the room. So I need to get rid of some of the furniture and I need to get the paint and then over time, over the course of a few months, you'll see this room get transformed and I'm so excited. But thank you so much for tuning in and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.